Tonight, we got some new video showing two teenagers accused of stealing a truck, damaging a high school football field, and almost running over a police officer. This happened at Mill Creek High School in Gwinnett County, and 11 Alive's Cody Alcorn is live tonight from the school. Cody, is there any idea why these teens may have targeted this school specifically? Well, Jennifer, we don't have the answer to that, but I can tell you the district just sent us some pictures in the last half hour of the damage. It appears these teens actually drove through a fence to get out on this field before damaging it, even taking out a set of bleachers. But how this all started, Gwinnett police say that these teens were over in a Lawrenceville neighborhood breaking into cars when they came across a truck with the keys inside. Now, after taking that truck, causing all the ruckus over here, police say they tracked them down about three Three miles from where I'm standing at the school. Gwinnett County Police trying to stop two teens in a stolen truck. Jumping back in his car. 411 note in the call. Vehicle struck my leg. A short pursuit until the 17 year old crashed into a car on Hamilton Mill Road. You see the teen running in front of the officer. The officer takes off after the 16 year old passenger, eventually catching up to her in a nearby parking lot, quickly finding out. Stop, you're going to get tased! The second team still running. Keep going after him. Officers on the ground getting help from the sky with the agency's aviation unit. And then we need probably one or two units in second gear in case he pops out. It wasn't long until officers spotted him. I think he's in the parking lot. Uh, unit that just pulled into second gear. He's, uh, he's standing in the parking lot. He's got his hands up. The 17-year-old driver was hauled off to the county jail. The 16-year-old passenger at the youth detention center tonight, and they're facing a slew of charges, and at least some are very serious, including aggravated assault on a law enforcement officer. Live in Gwinnett County, Cody Alcorn, 11 Alive News. And that could have had deadly consequences, Cody. Thanks a lot for the update there.